And St. Landry Parish, the remains of an Opelousas woman were finally put to rest today. As News 10's Dawson D'Amico reports, Erica Hunt went missing in 2016 and her remains were discovered two years later. Today, Hunt's family were finally able to give her a proper goodbye. Erica Nicole Hunt went missing in July of 2016. Her remains were later found two years later. And today, her family is finally able to put Hunt to rest as the search for who was responsible continues. The last time Hunt was seen by her family was the weekend of July 4th, 2016 at a family gathering in Opelousas. Two years later, in December of 2018, remains were found near Villeplatte. In 2021, investigators were able to identify those remains as belonging to Hunt. That is when her missing persons case turned into a homicide investigation led by the state police with the help of Evangeline Parish Sheriff's Office and Opelousas Police. Her remains were held in a DNA lab for years until finally being brought back to the family so they can have a proper memorial for the life she lived. It was a good feeling, even though we still haven't got justice yet, but it was a good feeling to put a, to, uh, put a remains to rest. Hunt was a contributing member of the Opelousas community. She worked as a hairdresser and a loving mother to her daughter. Hunt's family and friends put this memorial together to remember her and find answers to what happened to their loved one. But we need some answers, and that's all we're asking for, some answers. Just like you say, justice for Erica. So this is what this is all about. It's hard, but we need the community help as well, because we can't do it by ourselves, not at all. Opelousas community leader and Hunt's uncle, Tyrone Glover, helped set the memorial up. He says this is important for Hunt's family to be able to get some form of closure they have wanted since they lost Hunt. It's a beautiful soul that we lost. You understand, Erica, beautiful daughter of hers. Her grandmother passed away, but her family members standing strong. They're standing behind me and on the side of me. They're standing strong. This is a sad day, but it's a beautiful day. In Opelousas, Dawson D'Amico, KLFY, News 10. Hunt's cause of death has not yet been released. If you have any information about her disappearance, you're asked to contact law enforcement.